Okay, I'm here with Danny Nix from Classic Performance Products. Danny's going to tell us a little bit about the braking system that we're going to put on this Square Body C10. Danny, uh, why don't you run me through what we're using in the rear, the front, and then let's talk about this master that you got. All right, so our rear is going to be our 49-inch style 12-inch uh, rear disc brake kit. We've got okay. integrated parking brake into the caliper. Oh, nice. Um, it's yeah, pretty clean setup. You don't have to run the, in any extra piece. Right, the, the little drum or anything like that that you see. Okay. Exactly, so that's pretty smooth. Um, the front is going to be our performance brake kit. This is a 11 and 3 quarter inch rotor. Okay. Um, it's on our forged aluminum hubs. We make the hub and the rotor in every bolt pattern, five lug and six lug. All right, so if I want to run truck wheels, if I want to run Chevy passenger wheels, I can do that. Yep, absolutely. Six lug, five lug, the whole gamut. It makes it really easy to make that change over um, when that happens. That's coupled with our big bore calipers. It's like an S10 style caliper. Okay. Other than it's bored out oversized. It's bigger, yeah. Yeah, so you get a lot more clamping force um, with that caliper. We also do these in a, in a 13 inch kit, um, but for this wheel, we're going to run the, this performance brake package. Okay. Um, booster wise, we've got our hydro right. stop kit. Um, I don't know if you're familiar with these things, but they're very bit. powerful. Okay. Very powerful. Um, hydraulic this is used in hydraulic power from this power steering system, right? Yeah, it's just going to tie okay. into the power steering system. It's a couple of quick close connections and a T fitting for the return. Okay. Very easy to install, but very powerful. This is our street beast that comes blacked out. Um, it's got a black billet mounting bracket. We got a black cover for the accumulator. We blacked out the master cylinder lid and bales, and we even offer a black proportioning valve. Okay. So it can all become blacked out when we put this in here. Now I see vacuum boosters on all kinds of stuff for years and years and years. What's different about this and, and why would a guy want to install something like this instead of one well, of those? This is way more powerful than, okay. than any vacuum booster is going to be for one. Um, another is if you put a, have a big cam, you don't have vacuum. Right, you're losing then, the vacuum signal, sure. And this is really the only option you're going to have. It makes up and for that loss, right? They've okay. been, yeah, this, this thing works so good. Very cool. Well, I'm excited to see how all this stuff performs. Uh, what do you say we start throwing parts on this truck? Let's get started. All right. 